Alto, California, the two greatest track and field powers in the world, the Soviet Union and the United States, meet for the fourth time. A huge crowd in Stanford Stadium sees Olympic champion Mrs. Wilma Rudolph Ward draw away from the field in the 100-meter dash to prove she's still the fastest woman runner in the world. Mrs. Ward's victory helps hold down Russia's winning margin in the separately scored women's meet. The men's 100-meter dash, it's a U.S. sweep. Bob Hayes and teammate Roger Sayers beating their Soviet rivals. Time, 10 and 2 tenths. Uncle Sam sprinters continue supreme. In the men's 110 meters high hurdles, two rivals on the American track scene battle for first place. The Russians are out of it as Jerry Tarr beats out teammate Hayes Jones in meet record time of 13 and 4 tenths. Uncle Sam adds another first when Ralph Boston again beats Igor Terovanezian in the broad jump with a leap of 26-9. Now the news of the day camera picks up Jim Beatty in a sparkling stretch performance which wraps up the 1500 meter race. The Mighty Might is running the equivalent of a 357 mile as he sets an American and meet record of 339 and 9 tenths. Uncle Sam has 14 firsts to eight for Russia. The visitors have their greatest individual performer in Valery Brummel. The high jump sensation is breaking his own world record by leaping seven feet five inches. It's a big one for the Russians, although the U.S. trackmen beat them 128 points to 107. <laughs>